Hi everyone. It's it is me, Sailor Moon, and it is me, Sailor Mini Moon. And today we're going to talk about you know this one thing that comes up a lot, but so in Sailor Moon worship in Sailor Moon worship, how does that play out? Now, if you go into the Toei or the Viz offshoot, worship plays a big thing in the Sailor Moon, you know. But if you looked at the Deke one, they don't really somewhat talk about worship that much. I mean, but it is talked about. Oh, I already, we're amazing going with this. So, there are two warships that are played in Sailor Moon. What are many warships out there? And everyone wants their warship to be on looked, and it is what it is. So, the first warship out there is Christendom. And that does play a big thing in the Sailor Moon probably more times than most folks think. And then there's, I guess, Sintunism, whatever that other worship is that Ray does or believes in what Sailor Mars does or believes in <clears throat> I don't really know where I'm going with this all right, all right. it's enough ah so all right so here's the true film could I talk about that before so you know when you still like something like you still like WWE and there's going to be folks out there who don't like WWE anymore and never did. It's their own business. But they're going to come at you. They're going to seek to make you feel guilty, make you feel ashamed as if you liking something that they do not like anymore or never liked make you feel like that you're wrong. You know? <clears throat> like that's what they like to do. You know, it's like they have this oversight or law they made up, you know, that says you can only like something as long as I like it. Once I don't like it anymore, or once I'm never like, um, you can't like it anymore. And if you don't follow that oversight, then they'll start the guilt thing and the shaming of you. Or if not, they'll start the scathing and the shame, the scathing of it. You know, you know how that's like. You probably know someone who behaves like that. And no need what, no need how you spin it or no need what you say. They're going to behave as if their booty ached. <clears throat> yeah, you're right. This should be the last time we ever talk about this. You know, and then we'll be done with it. So, yeah, they be a right, Sailor Moon. They be hate as if they're the ones who are booty ached. You know, they're the ones that are either bitching at you or shaming you or guilting you for still liking WWE when they don't like it anymore. You know, it's like, all right, you don't like it anymore. You don't watch it anymore. Whatever the grounds is, good for you. Why can't you give me the same on look? For what I'm giving you. Well, it doesn't work that way. Not in some of their minds, it doesn't work that way. It's almost as if they want everyone to like what they like and hate what they hate. Why? I don't know. You know, that's just the way they are. You know, and, uh, you know. Yeah, and I get it. These and I understand why a lot of these folks don't like it anymore, but it doesn't irk me. <clears throat> you know, not having blood and not can't do power drivers anymore and you can't curse anymore. Is that a big deal? I guess to some of them it is. To some of them they grew up with that. So in their mind they think that's a standard. They're like, "Well, every wrestling business does it." Well, you're right, Sailor Mini Moon. You're right about that. They're like, every wrestling business does it, yeah, and you hope the wrestlers doing it have good timing. They're like, well, every other wrestling business lets them bleed, yeah, and you hope they're being answerable for it. So they make a big deal out of WWE being PG or being kin-friendly or whatever you want to call it. 
you know, it's like in their mind, they never, it's like in their mind, they still can't get over it. They still can't get, they, in their mind, they just, in their mind, they think that WWE was going to, they think in their mind, I don't know what they think, and <clears throat> I can't say it right, but in their mind, it's like they believe those two lifespans should have never ended. That they're like, oh, you should never go back to being kin friendly. Well, for some of these folks, for some of these folks, it is what it is. So they make a big deal out of that. And then they make a big deal like, oh, wrestlers don't bleed anymore. It's like, well, how many fights do they have to bleed in? They do bleed every once in a while. They do bleed. But it's not good enough for them when they do, you know. And then they want them to say curse words. Well, they do every once in a while. It might not be their beloved curse words. But they do every once in a while. But it's not good enough for them. If you tell them it's not good enough for them, it's the truth. Because that's how they behave like. Only they like to guilt you and shame you and say, Oh, you're booty ached. You're this. You're that. You're wrong. You know... You're wrong for liking it or whatever. I don't know. All I know at the end of the day, I still like WWE and I still watch it. And I'll always watch it. No need what anyone says or what anyone does. You know. And sure, WWE might not be the most beloved wrestling business now. It probably never was. You know. Folks... You know, a lot of folks only liked WWE when it was grown up. Like, in their mind, they believed that was the only true lifespans there were. And they can't back it up anymore. Well, all right, good for you, then. If you folks want to believe that the past was more good than the now, okay, that's that's good. That's your fault and belief. But I still like WWE and I always watch it. And I've been watching it since 9 between 92 YL. The end of the gathering lifespan going into the new lifespan. You know? And I watched it during the mood lifespan. And the unkind wrath lifespan. Mean wrath lifespan or whatever you want to call it. Into the now or the new or whatever. Yeah, you're right, Sailor Moon. At the end of the day, either you like it or you don't like it, that's your own business. But don't go around and shame and scave and don't want to go around and shame and, and, and guilt anyone who still likes WWE when someone like you don't like it anymore or never liked it anymore. All right, that's it for us. If you like the film, Falls Out Sailor Moon for Life. Or watch the last film you made yesterday over here. I'm Sailor Moon. I'm Sailor Mini Moon. Hope you like this film. Bye.